Hello and welcome to this tutorial on trading with moving averages. In this video, we'll be discussing what moving averages are, how they are calculated, and how traders can use them to make informed investment decisions. So, what is a moving average? A moving average is a technical analysis tool that helps to smooth out price data and identify trends. It is calculated by taking the average of a particular security's price over a set period of time, and then plotting that average on a chart. As new price data becomes available, the moving average is recalculated and plotted on the chart, creating a line that moves along with the price data. There are several different types of moving averages, including simple moving averages, SMAs, exponential moving averages, EMAs, and weighted moving averages, WMAs. The main difference between these types of moving averages is the way that they weight the price data in their calculations. So, how can traders use moving averages to make informed investment decisions? Here are a few ways. Trend identification, by plotting multiple moving averages on a chart, traders can identify the overall trend of a security. For example, if a security's price is consistently above its 50-day moving average, it might be in an uptrend. On the other hand, if the security's price is consistently below its 50-day moving average, it might be in a downtrend. Support and resistance, moving averages can also act as support and resistance levels, meaning that the price of a security might have difficulty breaking through a certain moving average. For example, if a security's price is consistently bouncing off its 50-day moving average, that moving average might act as a resistance level. Crossover signals, when two moving averages of different time periods cross over each other, it can be a signal to buy or sell. For example, if a security's 50-day moving average crosses above its 200-day moving average, it might be a buy signal. On the other hand, if the 50-day moving average crosses below the 200-day moving average, it might be a sell signal. It's worth noting that moving averages are just one of many technical analysis tools available to traders, and they should be used in conjunction with other indicators and fundamental analysis. It's always a good idea to do your own research and consult with a financial advisor before making any investment decisions. I hope this tutorial has helped you understand the basics of moving averages and how they can be used in trading. If you're interested in learning more about technical analysis or other trading strategies, be sure to check out additional resources online or consider taking a course or workshop.